Okay, today we're going to be talking about mass and weight. And today is relatively um, easy compared to the things that we've been doing lately, hopefully. So something that you need to know is the definition. The, a mass is just the amount of matter in an object, and it's measured in milligrams, kilograms, oh, I'm sorry. It's measured in milligrams, grams, and kilograms. So you know when you see those... Um, measurements at the end of the, a number that they're talking about the mass of an object. Okay, so what you need to know is that the mass of an object does not change if you go from Earth to the moon. So that's going to take me to weight. Okay, weight is, uh, excuse me, weight is the force of gravity on an object and it's measured in ounces, pounds, and tons. Now, Weight is something that does change. If you have an astronaut, an astronaut on Earth and he goes to the moon, he was going to weigh something, like say he weighs 150 pounds, he's going to weigh 150 pounds on the Earth, but he's not going to weigh anything. He's going to be zero weight on the moon, but his mass will stay the same. Okay, so what you're going to need to know in order to complete your, your work today is these equalities. You need to know that, and I should have got my pointer out. I'm going to get it out now just so that I can, because I love the pointer. Okay, one milligram, 1,000 milligrams is equal to one gram, and one gram is equal to one kilogram. So when you're doing your work and and they're asking for conversions, this is going to be the page that you're going to want to come back to to see those. Now we also have conversions for weight. We have 6 ounces equals 1 pound and 2,000 pounds equals 1 ton. Sounds like 1 ton. Alright, so here are some examples. Okay, 2 kilograms is how many pounds? Well, or I'm sorry, two kilograms is how many grams? Well, I know that one kilogram, based on the previous page, is equal to 1,000 grams. So if I need to know how, many, how much two cal kilograms is, I just multiply two times 1,000, and I get 2,000. So two kilograms equals 2,000 grams. Okay, that's not so hard. It gets a little tricky when it asks about halves. So let's look at this next one. Okay, half a pound is how many ounces? Well, again, based on that previous page, I know that one pound is 16 ounces. So if I multiply one half by 16, or I could also just divide 16 by two, I get eight. So half a pound is equal to eight ounces. So again, what today is gonna take is for you to be able to go back to this page, figure out what the question is asking, and use these equalities to solve your problems. Okay, now what if we want to add these things together? This is where it's going to get a little trickier, but it's still not too difficult, okay? So I'm just going to add these terms. So um, 2 plus 6 is 8, 1 plus 0 is 1, and then 7 plus 2 is 7, 8, 9 is 9. Now here's the thing, okay? I have this 18 right here. I have 18 ounces, but if I go back to that one page where, has, where I have the conversions, oops, sorry, then I know right here that 16 ounces equals one pound. So let's go back here. My answer is 18 ounces. Well, I'm gonna take 16 ounces out of here. So minus 16. I'm gonna add a pound to this nine. And I'm gonna get 10 pounds and 2 ounces. Okay? So again, that one page is really, really important that you understand how to use those conversions. Okay? So let's try another one. I actually don't want to add these. I want to subtract these. So I'm going to switch it really quick. Okay. Let's go back here. Okay. So I have um, 
9 pounds and 10 ounces minus 7 pounds and 12 ounces. Okay, so I'm going to have to borrow a pound from this 9 because 10 is smaller than 12. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a pound out of here. I'm going to make this an 8. Now a pound is 16 ounces, so I'm going to add that to 10 and I'm going to get 26 ounces. So 26 minus 12 is... 14 and 8 minus 7 is 1. So I'm left with 1 pound and 14 ounces. Now this reminds me a lot of subtracting mixed numbers when you have to borrow from the fraction. Okay, if you have any questions, give me a call, but I know you can do this.